interview? Yes. Thank you. Uh, tell us your reaction when you first saw the script. There wasn't a script. <laughs> uh, there was a 13-page outline and a very detailed character analysis for each person in the movie. And my husband said to all of us, uh, okay, you know where you have to go. You've got to get from A to B to C in every scene. And it's very clearly uh, defined. Now you say it the way you want to say it and you get there. Uh, obviously, Blake's control was over all of it. And after we'd done much rehearsal and all put in our two cents, he had the final say. So. Actually, it was a very small outline that we saw, and it was such a family endeavor. How could we help but, I mean, how could we not love it? You know, it was for Blake, it was for Dad, and all our friends are, are, are part of the film, too. So it was just a very intimate film that Blake wanted to make, and this is the result. Tell me about the family unit that Blake is trying to get in the movie. Well, it is, it, the film is about a family over about 48 hours, uh, over the span of 48 hours. And uh, I think he, he said, well, it's a family very like us. Why, why don't I cast close to home? And that's what he did. My, our two daughters play our two daughters. Jack Lemon's son plays Jack Lemon's son, who plays my husband. Jack Lemon's wife, Felicia Farr, is in the movie also, and a lot of good chums and friends. And it, it became a real ensemble piece. Do you have to prepare for this? Oh, a great deal. There was probably more preparation than in a script that's just handed to you and, and you do your work. Uh, this one, you, you really had to dig, dig deep down and be very, very responsible for your character. You know, it took a lot of preparation and time to think, to think about it. Yes, it did. Uh, having said that, it was a very freewheeling and very emancipating experience because there was a lot of kind of fresh air coming in too. What do you think uh, the people, the movie crowd, their reaction to the movie will be? I'm hoping that people are going to identify with the film. It is about a family. I think the film deals with areas that we've all been at some point in our lives, whether it be the problems with a husband and wife, mother and daughter, father and son. Everybody can identify with it in some way. It sounds like a real movie. Uh, real people. It's, it's, it is about life, which is why it's called That's Life. But it's also very funny, very endearing. Thank you. You're welcome. Sally, can I have one short interview with you?